And, and the reason I know this is because because in, in the Orient, what's called the Orient now, let's just call it China, Confucianism, Buddhism, Taoism, they don't have the same concept of sin we have. They don't, they don't approach it from that same direction at all. They, you know, this is a very deep topic. Um, Confucianism was uh, kind of ran the world for like a thousand years, you know. And of course, Buddha was a, a holy man who achieved grace through some unusual means. They, their whole concept of morality is different. So it's the Western Empire that's filled with sin because you conceptualize things in terms of sin. That's just the way it happened in, in the Western, just like the Roman language is different from Mandarin. The morality of the East is far different from the morality of the West. There was no contact till about 1400, when Marco Polo was able to sail into Japan. And he was astonished by what he saw. He, he, first thing he did was wrote a letter back to the Pope to telling him, describing what he was seeing over there in this other part of the world. 